Okay. <clears throat> Want to make it clear that there are absolute who whom appear to me to be nut jobs out there on this subject. Um, Peter made it clear that as reasonable as you may sound, as as there might there may be or as there, or as there is, or what's accepted as, as reasonable, uh, at least a possibility, um, would be dismissed as far as Christianity. So here we go. Peter says, Know first of all that in the last days mockers will come with their own mocking, following after their own lusts, and saying, where is the promise of his coming? I can't fit everything in these videos. I may have to do some more videos. I don't know if I'm going to or want to. Where is the promise of his coming? For since the, for, for since the fathers fell, fell asleep, euphemism, you know, that's, that's just biblical language. You know, we'd say died. All continues just as it was from the beginning of creation. Um... It actually might not be what I was looking for here. Oh, I'm thinking, maybe I'm thinking about it. Anyway, so that, you know, they're going to say, you know, just, you know, you can't even say anything. You can't say, well, I think this. This is why I think that. No, 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 you can't do that. For when they maintain, maintain this, it escapes their notice. That by the word of God, the heavens existed long ago, and the earth was formed out of water and by water, through which the world at that time was destroyed, being flooded with water. But by his word, the present heavens and earth are being reserved for fire, kept in the day of judgment and destruction of ungodly men. Um, Paul. Paul, 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 let's see what we got here. Flip, flip, flip. See? Okay. I mean, people might get upset that I don't read this enough. Or they don't think I read this enough. Or it doesn't show up that I read this enough. Oh, you know, let's, let's hear it. Okay. It's got to be on video. Me reading. You know, anyway. I saw him. Okay. Blah, 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 blah. Preach your word. Jesus Christ, who is to judge the living and the dead. For the time will come when they will not endure sound doctrine, or they, or another way, another translation, same meaning. They will not put up a sound doctrine, but to have their ears tickled, they will accumulate for themselves teachers. This is why, you know, this is why people don't believe this stuff, because nobody's believable, nobody's authentic. They will accumulate for themselves teachers in accordance to accordance to their own desires they will turn away their ears from the truth and will turn aside to myths was this Maybe this wasn't it oh it was back here I'm, i'll find it so i stuffed it that's how i find stuff flip a little bit back Paul to Timothy, but realize this, in the last days difficult times will come, for men will be lovers of themselves, like our political leaders are. Lovers of money, boastful, arrogant revilers. Boastful, arrogant revilers. Oh, look what you or your, it's your fault. Oh, well, you know, look at how terrible you are. Oh, you just, you're just, you should just look at you. Oh, I'm much better than you. Look at you. You're terrible. And we got that all over. They call themselves Christians. Please don't use that name. Disobedient to parents. Ungrateful. Or unthankful, I suppose. Unholy. Unloving. Come on. You think people were like this when I was a kid? I mean, like this? You can see it. It's on the internet. Irreconcilable. I'm not ever, ever, ever talking to that guy ever again. Oh, no, oh, I'll never. 
hate that, you know, just irreconcilable, malicious gossips, without self-control, brutal, haters of good, treacherous, like our political leaders, reckless, nuts, just, they're just, they're extreme and they just, type people stop at nothing, conceited lovers of pleasure rather than lovers of God, holding a form of godliness, although they have denied its power, avoid such men as these. So there's supposed to be one government, or at least one controlling entity that tells people, hey, this is what you're going to do. You're going to worship what we tell you to worship. You can see that. Um, then another angel, a third one, followed him, them, saying with a loud voice, if anyone worships the beast, the beast and his image, and receives a mark on his forehead or, or on his hand, he will also drink of the wine of the wrath of God, which is mixed <coughs> in full strength in the cup of his egg, <coughs> pardon me, <coughs> anger. And he will be tormented with fire and brimstone in the presence of the holy angels and in the presence of the Lamb, Revelation. And the smoke of their torment goes up. This may be actually for ages and ages, but it says forever and ever. I've looked up this stuff before. They have no rest day and night, those who worship the beast in his image, and whoever receives the mark of his name. Here is a perseverance of the saints who keep the commandments of God and their faith in Jesus. There's so much more <clears throat> that I'd like to say that I could say. <clears throat> it just won't all fit in. Um, God bless you. I just, I can't express how it's so obvious to me that whether you think Christianity's bunk or not, that we're heading towards the United States taking over for sure Canada, probably through diplomacy, um, and Mexico, and probably more, and then China reaching out, taking other countries. We're in trouble. Um, I'm not saying when it's going to happen. It's going to be soon. And for those who buy into this load of crap, which I don't think it's a load of crap, but I'm just saying in so many words, come quickly, Lord Jesus.